Appalachia Online, Captain. I know most of you love America. Good old red, white, and blue. But those of us who served at Mariposa know something. America failed. Not because of its citizens who lived clean lives filled with hardship in a never-ending war. Certainly not because of its fighting men and women. God bless them. No, its leaders failed us. Senators, generals, presidents, all those bastards. Their failure almost destroyed all mankind. But I look around here, and I see survivors. People too stubborn, people too damn ornery to die. We've fought we've endured and we finally have a small patch of safety but having a home isn't enough we need something more what we need is purpose we cannot look to the america of old for that purpose we have to build our own so tonight as we break bread together, let us forge together something new, something strong, something we can be proud of, something we can build upon. We'll preserve what's best of what's come before us and use it. And one day, we will reclaim what was lost. Let us forge a brotherhood. Congratulations, Appalachia. Paladin Taggarty told me of your victory at Huntersville. I know it was costly, but future generations will thank you, as I am thanking you now. It makes me proud, but that's not why I'm calling. One of the Brotherhood's standing orders is being on the lookout for valuable technology, anything that would help us in our efforts. But as I look in every direction, I see chaos. The lights are out, and men have become little better than barbarians. Civilization. Civilization is something I think of every day. <laughs> I know Lizzie is probably sick of the word by now. To rebuild that, to reclaim that, our successors are gonna need the secrets of the past. And those secrets are in danger of slipping through our fingers forever. So far, our scribes have been tools to help protect our knights and maintain our bases. That needs to change. The Brotherhood is going to be more than an armed fighting force. We are going to be the guardians of civilization! So we have to grab every schematic, every holotape, every book, every goddamn note that holds the building blocks of the old world before it is too late. Our scribes will hold on to them, preserve them, Perhaps even progress beyond them, and the knights will protect them. Launch around a precious seed. One day, when the time is right, that seed will grow, and a new civilization will be born. This, this is why we were born. Don't you see it? Helping your fellow man is a good goal, a soldier's goal. But this, we will be the catalyst that changes. World. I'm sure you have questions. Ballad integrity is fully briefed. I have every faith in you, Appalachia. Elder Maxon, out. Overseer's log, Camp Venture. Just who was this Brotherhood of Steel? Survivalists? Former army personnel? They, they took their training and their call signs seriously, that's for certain. Organized, efficient, access to hardware? You'd think they'd be ruling West Virginia by now. But they're gone. If they're following military logic, then they'll have a fortified headquarters somewhere. And a leader. Someone who knew what they were planning.
you mind coming back later? I really just I need some time alone. Forever, actually. It's... It's my sister. I thought it was over this already. She took her final stand here. At Fort Defiance. I should have been here with her. I'm such a coward. Aside from bringing back the dead? No, there's not. But I appreciate the offer. Take this. It's better off with you than me. This is Allegheny Asylum. Or rather, Fort Defiance. That's what the Brotherhood of Steel called it when they took up residence here. Fort Defiance. Defiance against the scorched threat. Well, just because you defy doesn't mean you succeed. <laughs> They're all gone now. Every last one of them. They took their last stand here. They thought they could drive back the scorched, but they were overwhelmed. I don't know. How am I supposed to feel about the people my sister died for? If it weren't for the Brotherhood, then she might have left with me. I'd still be with me now. Or... Or maybe... She would have just found another cause to die for. That they're monsters. They'll kill anything and everything that isn't them. And for what? What's the reason? What's the reason that my sister had to die? Sorry. It just feels so cruel. To answer your question, I don't know much. Why should I be? I've got nothing to live for anymore. When the Scorched came to Appalachia, I ran away. Kaede wanted me to join the Brotherhood with her. <laughs> but I was afraid to fight. Afraid to die. Now I see it's better to die for something than to live for nothing. Okay. Me? I'm a pathetic waste of life named Jonah. My parents are long gone. Killed during the war. My sister, Kaede, was a Brotherhood Knight. The best of them, without a doubt. She was so determined to see the world through to a better future. So she fought for it. Here, at Fort Defiance. Now I get to see the future, and she doesn't. Because I made one too many mistakes, I can never take back. This miserable existence is my penance. Maybe not, but I don't have the will for it. I've always been weak. Just let me mourn in peace. Gladly. Thanks. If you're hearing this, stranger, I'm dead. The Brotherhood is dead. But I'm relieved. Relieved there is someone, anyone, alive. I honestly don't care if you're Chinese, American, or whatever. You're a human being. Listen, I don't have much time, but the Scorched are more of a threat than you can ever imagine. You have to find a way past the security I installed. If you're former military, all you need is your government-issued military ID card. If not, find a way. I know, 
some ghost. Probably isn't very persuasive. But look past your own skin and consider there's so much at stake. We did. And that's why I'm going out to die. Ad Victorium. Scribe Grant signing out. Overseer's Log, Allegheny. A mental asylum as a last stand against the scorched. Brave, crazy, and crazy brave. The Army way. At least I'm pretty sure the Brotherhood had former U.S. Army members. Judging by the security systems. If only they had survived. What I wouldn't give to have a few of America's finest watching my back right now. As it is, I'll have to find out how they were planning to combat the Scorched on my own. Once I can figure out a way through these doors...